this is the 10th annual Jubilee Roast. They're the most fun. It's a time when um, our best and brightest in Montgomery County allow us to poke fun at them and tease them, all for a good cause, helping the developmentally disabled. Jubilee is an incredible source to Montgomery County and to the greater Washington area. And the things that they do for all people, especially those with developmentally dis disabled people, is incredible. A lot of people come. They raise a lot of money but they raise uh, awareness and visibility for the folks that they're taking care of. Well, we're going to have a big gala here this evening, and a lot of our clients from Jubilee are here, and you'll be able to meet, walk around and meet them. And we have a silent auction, and we're going to have some special items in the live auction. And tonight they're going to be honoring Mark Shriver. Well, most of our funding comes from the state of Maryland and Montgomery County, but that, you know, the funding helps us do more. I mean, you, that it's sort of basic funding, and this makes helps us be creative, helps us do higher quality services. It's, you know, kind of icing on the cake. Our goal here is to, is to raise money to help uh, develop money disabled people, um, mainly in housing, but also in other things. Uh, people don't realize the challenges that they face going through life, but we have the housing, we help them find the housing. Um, there are people who live with them in the housing to help them and get them through, and some of them are um, more highly functioning and can work and so forth and earn some money. So they can be very depend independent and, um, and it's all good. It's given us and our daughter freedom. It's given my daughter a life. She has, she's not mommy's little girl anymore. She was so super attached to me and, you know, just totally my child. And when she moved to Jubilee in her, in her early 30s, she suddenly became her own person. And it's just, it's wonderful watching her blossom and have her own home and, and know that if something happened to us, that she's taken care of. And that's the, that's the number one consideration for all families. Well, I think Jubilee is so important to the community because it actually serves the members of our community that um, it, it, not only do they need our help, but they're just looking for a way to make it on their own. So it's, it's the old story of uh, teaching them to fish, and that's what Jubilee is really all about. It's tremendous. They make such an impact on the individuals, people with developmental disabilities, their family, the community, the neighborhood. So I'm really excited to be here. I'm also excited about Mark Driver being recognized and roasted tonight. Uh, his work, his dedication to uh, serving children, uh, uh, save our children, and, and the work that he's done, that his family's done. So it's real exciting to be here this evening in Montgomery County. So I'm here because of my good friend Mark Shriver, and I've got some good stories to tell about him. Well, I think Mark Shriver, I, I think the world of Mark Shriver, so uh, I'm just glad that he's here. Mark and his whole family have been very, very good to our communities, and we're very fortunate to have him here. We're honoring a very great a leader, Mark Shriver, a great community activist, a compassionate uh, champion of kids and families. You couldn't have honored a better person than Mark Shriver. Jubilee does wonderful work here in Montgomery County. Uh, it's a role for a role model for not only Maryland but really for the country. So Jubilee is a great organization. And if somebody makes a little fun of me, it's fine. Montgomery County's home and it's also home to a big movement to include people with developmental differences in all aspects of life, whether it's work or home, uh, whether it's employment. Uh, so it's a great night. I'm proud to be here with Jubilee. I'm proud of my mother and father's uh, commitment to people with developmental differences and my family's ongoing commitment to it. I would urge everyone to go to our website and uh, donate, learn more about us, get involved, volunteer, all of that.